receiver touchscreen operations. The real-time parameters and working status of the receiver and the transmitter are shown on the upper and lower parts of the OLED touchscreen. On the upper part, you can see the current recording mode, receiver gain, screen lock status, wireless signal strength, and receiver battery level. The selected camera models displayed when recommended camera settings are set and a camera is connected. When the 32-bit float recording is enabled, the 32BF icon is displayed. A headphone icon is displayed if a headphone is inserted to the monitor port. On the lower part, you can view the transmitter gain. Red frame on the screen means the transmitter is recording, and the absence of red frame indicates that recording has stopped. You can also see the transmitter battery level and real-time volume bars. If the bars are green, audio volume is appropriate. Yellow and red volume bars indicate that volume is slightly or too loud. When noise reduction is enabled, a noise reduction icon is shown. Swipe down from the top of the home screen to access the control menu. Tap receiver settings to enter the submenu. Recording mode can be set to mono, M, safety track, MS, and stereo, S. Recommended camera settings allow you to achieve a better audio experience based on the preset camera gain. Receiver gain. Move the slider to adjust the receiver gain. Volume. Move the slider to adjust the volume. Power on off camera simultaneously. When enabled, the receiver will automatically power on and off with the camera. When connected to the camera, receiver auto off can be enabled or disabled. When enabled, the receiver automatically shuts down after 30 minutes of no use when not connected to the transmitter. Link device. Manually link the transmitter with the receiver based on the on-screen instructions. Transmitter settings can be used to set low cut, transmitter gain, 32-bit float recording, rec stop lock, auto record, storage, vibration notification, and LED indicator. Tap the 32-bit float icon to enable the 32-bit float recording function. This feature is only supported for standalone recording use. Rec Stop Lock. Once enabled, users cannot stop the standalone recording of the transmitter via the record button. You can swipe up from the bottom edge of the home screen to stop standalone recording. Auto Record. When enabled, the transmitter automatically starts recording independently as soon as it is powered on or taken out from the charging case. Storage. You can view the remaining recording time of the transmitter. Tap on the transmitter that needs to be formatted, slide the bar to the right, and then follow the prompts to format the transmitter. Tap settings to set brightness, language, time, and date. You can also check the firmware version, compliance information, and reset the receiver to the default settings on this page. Swipe up from the bottom of the home screen to enter the transmitter settings. Swipe up on the left side of the home screen to control left transmitter, and swipe up on the right side of the home screen to control right transmitter. Tap Rec icon, and the transmitter will start independent recording. Tap the microphone icon to mute or unmute the transmitter and tap the noise reduction icon to enable noise reduction for the transmitter.